What's up, DP? I'm Sienna Valentine, and I'm here with... Amelia Vandermey. Sage Honickman. We're here at the Arlington Theater for the Santa Barbara International Film Festival, where eight actors will be awarded with the Virtuoso Award. Hi, my name is uh, Sienna Valentine. I'm a teen press with the local high school called Dos Pueblos. So my question for you is, uh, May December talks a lot about a lot about you know relationships and societal expectations. So how do you think this message affects young people? You know, that's a great question. I think, you know, the, when when it comes to Todd Haynes and like his films, what he does is, is he 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 really kind of like leaves it to the audience to kind of like sit with these questions, these uncomfortable questions and these feelings that they may have and he, in a way, you know, he eliminates any sort of judgment that one may, you know, he's not really, he, he's setting the table for the audience and you're kind of making your own decision as to what you believe to be true or not true. Okay, thank you so much. And uh, so we have a daily news show, so if you could give a shout out, maybe say, you know, my name is Charles Melton, this is DP News, and it starts now, or something okay, like that. Okay, hey, my name is Charles Melton, and this is DP News, and it starts now. Thank you so much. Have a good evening. Yeah. And you got an, into acting pretty young. What advice would you have for other young actors or people who want to work in the film industry? Love it. Use it. Use it. I mean, like, the best thing about this is that we get to, like, have all these different personalities and characters we get to play in. So you get to learn through other people's lives. And the, my favorite part about myself is that I've been a nomad since I was a kid, and I always love meeting new people and getting to talk and getting to hear stories and see if I can bring those stories into my own life. And um, so any little kids out there wanting to start, start, you know what I mean? If it's something that you want, chase it as much as you can. If you don't understand it, then ask the questions and figure out them for yourself, you know? Go for it, because it's so much fun. We get to be in LA and doing premieres and stuff. I think I got to bounce, you guys. Thank yeah. you so much. Thank it was nice to so meet much. you. Yeah, so sweet. <laughs> Hopefully get all three of them. <laughs> and you tell me a little bit about your film and the message that you wanted to send to your audiences. Yeah, of course. So the, the, my film, Good Boy, is a short film that I made. Um, uh, I wrote and directed it. It's uh, very much a love letter to my mum. So I had this like fantastic, slightly crazy, brilliant, uh, naughty mum who I was very, very close to. And uh, unfortunately, she died uh, four years ago now. Um, and so this film was me trying to work out what life is without her and like, how do you move on um, in life when you've lost someone that important to you? So it's, 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 it's in part that, me trying to figure this out, but it's also uh, meant as a real love letter and a celebration of her. Um, how do you think that will resonate with younger audiences? I think culturally we're not very good at talking about grief and I think it's really important that we get good at talking about grief because it's going to happen to all of us. We're all going to lose someone, unfortunately. Um, so I hope that my film encourages people to sort of uh, hug, hug these people while they're alive and, and also uh, n you know, not be afraid when they lose them and to sort of not be afraid to talk about their loss. Um, you know, it's, it's okay. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm so sorry. We need to keep it moving, but yeah, of course. Thank I'm you. So nice sorry, I coughed you. at the last minute. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> so there's lots of talented actors here tonight that you're presenting awards to. What qualities do you admire most in their performances? Oh my gosh, how they dig deep and stay really true, and um, they uh, uh, they find the truth in every character and um, they're committed to that. Like every time you see Andrew Scott on, on screen, you're going to see something well thought out, well considered, deeply felt and smart and funny. And that's what I love about it. Uh, uh, all those actors, I just happen to kind of be in love with him. <laughs>